Um, I just want to share with you a journal page that I did for 311 Vandals Crystals Birthday Giveaway Challenge. Um, I've had this journal for a while and I, I haven't actually journaled in about six months. So this was a, a good excuse to get back in there and do something that I haven't done. I just feel very challenged when doing this. This is almost like making a card for me. I never know where to start and it's just difficult. You can see I threw a tag in there because I just got overwhelmed with the whole page. But I did it and I had fun creating it and what what we were supposed to do is, like I said, add do a layout, smash book page, or a journal page. And we were supposed to have like a New Year's resolution or like a word in there that, that um, I don't know how to describe that. But because she said something about a one word layout. I'm not really familiar with that. But anyway, my kind of New Year's resolution I, is kind of different than most. And mine is to let things go. And I'm not going to get really into deep on why I feel that way. Um, because... I just deleted two videos because it got too deep. I, I, I like to keep those light and fun and not be depressing um, or, you know, too in depth. But let it go. Just let whatever bothers me, just let it go and move on. Um, but I, I what I did was, um, first of all, I used some paint and I used my fingers and I just kind of moved it all around the page as much as I wanted. And then I used some modeling paste. Um, with a Prima um, stencil and, I, I, and it's basically covered up now but you can see a little bit of it here and um, I also used some shimmer acrylic paint um, a little bit of glitter I mod podge the stamps on to, I, I stamped them onto dictionary pages and then I mod podge them onto the paper this is a Tim Holtz stamp that I just stamped on there. And these are Tim Holtz letter like stickers. And this is just a paper scrap. I put a Ranger tag on here and I sprayed it with some Delusion Spray. I think those are from Ranger. And I used my heating tool to dry everything so it dried quickly. This is a Tim Holtz stamp. I mean, die cut with glitter paper and then a little, the, a little, uh, it's kind of a glossy paper for a wing. This is just a floral trim. These are some goodies I, I got. Oh God, I can't think of who I got them from, but in, um, somebody sent me these. And then this is a little bead with, um, some, some of this beautiful trim on here. And, um, Gosh, I really love this trim. I wish I could remember who, who gave it to me. Um, but she also said she wanted it to have a blue element. So I love crafting in this blue, especially this one here. I think it's so beautiful. And I love all the colors. And So, Crystal, I hope this is what you had in mind. I wasn't exactly sure. I tried to find some videos of people, you know, that have already done their pages, but I, I, maybe I didn't look hard enough. So anyway, let me know what everybody thinks and happy birthday, Crystal. And thanks for having such a fun challenge. And you kind of made me do something I haven't done in a while. Thanks so much. And I hope you like it.